Good evening, everybody. A teacher accused of having sex with a special needs student facing charges tonight. Police say the 27-year-old New Milford woman was involved sexually with a 16-year-old boy. Brittany Larson has been fired from the Glen Home School in Washington. News 8's Aaron Logan covering the developments of this very disturbing case. We're told the staff member, 27-year-old Brittany Larson, who allegedly had sex with a 16-year-old student here, is married and pregnant. That, along with the fact that the Glen Home School is for special needs students, has people who know Larson shaking their head in disgust. 27-year-old Brittany Larson, seen here in her 2001 New Milford High School yearbook photo, arrested by state police, now facing serious felony charges. She's a beautiful woman. I've never... I'm, I'm floored because she is the sweetest woman I've ever met. I mean, you can see Karen Willis, here, a neighbor, was pretty surprised to hear the details. Yeah. State police say Larson was arrested and faces sexual assault charges. She's accused of having a sexual relationship with a 16-year-old special needs student at the Glenholm School, a private boarding school for young people ages 10 to 18 in Washington. That's strictly out of character that I see for her. State police say the charge stems from an investigation by the school. The school won't make any comments about the investigation because of federal privacy laws, but they did say Larson was fired. Okay. We told two parents outside the school about the arrest, and you can see they sped off immediately. Willis says this situation is difficult to listen to because someone in her family is a special needs student. And I do have a handicapped nephew, so I understand. And they're very vulnerable. And that's a shame. Next door at Larson's home, there was no sign of her husband, but another tenant in the home didn't want to hear another word about the arrest. But another neighbor was just disappointed she and confused. She's, what, she's on drugs or something? We don't know anything about her, just other than she was arrested. Willis is hoping Larson, a soon-to-be mom, lands on her feet and that this is all just a nightmare. It's really a shame. I pray for her. The Glenholm School is continuing their investigation. They're taking this situation very seriously. Again, Larson was terminated from the school. She'll be in court on Monday. On the scene in Washington, Aaron Logan, News 8.